lecture us on climate change, I am going to lecture you on climate change. Irfan Ali, the president of Guyana, sat down with the correspondent Stephen Shakur for an interview. However, this interview turned out of hands when Irfan Ali started schooling the journalist on the question of climate change. The reporter asked the president of Guyana about his country's commitment to mitigating the climate change while they were talking about preparations for the currently discovered oil deposits. At this moment, the interview, which had begun quietly, turned heated. Ali was heard saying, I would lecture you on climate change as he interrupted the journalist in a widely shared video on the argument in defense of the government's handling of the industry. The People's Progressive Party, Civic, which currently is in power in Guyana, posted the video of the entire interview including the contentious exchange on their YouTube channel. The president began the conversation by outlining Guyana's progress from its turbulent past, reportedly on which Shakur discusses the project of carbon emissions from oil and gas development of the coast in Guyana approximately 15 minutes into the conversation. Let me stop you right there. The president interrupted, adding, Do you know that Guyana has a forest that is combined the size of both England and Scotland together? A forest with 19.5 gigatons of carbon stored in it. A woodland that has survived thanks to us. Shakur at that time interrupts that does that give you the right to release all of this carbon? Ali then answers, does this give you the right to lecture us on climate change? Continuing the argument, I will give you a lesson on climate change because we have managed to preserve this forest which stores 19.5 gigatons of carbon for the benefit of all living things. You do not pay us for this, you do not respect it and even you do not care about it. This whole conversation went mad viral on social media. Over the last decade, Guyana has found a huge amount of oil and gas under its coastline waters. It now boasts a reserve of up to 11 billion barrels. This puts it in the top 20 in terms of potential on par with countries such as Norway, Brazil and Algeria. The smaller country which borders Venezuela, Brazil and Suriname in the South America's northeast corner currently boasts the fastest growing economy in Latin America. And so, the BBC attempted to shed light on Guyana's impending climate change. However, Shakur probably didn't expect Irfan Ali to act this way. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.